Hey everybody, Dan from On One here. Has this ever happened to you? You've opened a photo, you've done some retouching on it, and then you either print it out or you go to add other effects, and suddenly dust you never saw appears. Well, we've added a new tool to make that easier to find. It's located here inside of all of the retouching tools. So this works with the healing brush, the perfect eraser, the clone stamp, you name it. Let me show you how it works. First off, I'm just gonna start off with a healing brush. I'm gonna grab the obvious dust that I can see with my naked eye, right? So here's a little, little dusty right over here I'm gonna grab. Let's get rid of it. And there's kind of a big one right here on this cloud. I'll grab that one. There we go. Now, to the naked eye, it looks like I've got everything, right? Well, I guarantee you there's some extra dust lurking in this photo and in your photos as well. So we've added this cool little visualized dust checkbox. When you turn it on, what it does is it increases the contrast in the photo in a local contrast adjustment using our dynamic contrast filter. This makes all of the other dust in the photo pop out like crazy. You'll notice there's all sorts of other little dusties hiding inside of this photo. So now I can go along in this mode turned on and I can grab those little guys. I can see the neighborhood to make sure it's doing a good job of getting rid of them. These are this kind of little hidden dust that's going to appear later if I went to print this photo or when I go into effects and I start to add increasingly complex filters on top of it. So there we go. Oop, one more, there it is. Let's turn that off. There you go. Now I was able to see and find all of those hidden dust spots that would have caused me grief in the future just by using the visualize dust feature. There you go. Thanks for watching.